grab yourselves a coffee, a drink, whatever you fancy, because I believe this is going to be a long one. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is She Empowered and I'm Bernadette and today uh, as I said, this is going to be a long one because, um, so basically I've got loads of planners to go through that I want to sell and that, um, I am ready to part from and I decided to do an update of a video that I had already posted some time ago and this time I'm really going serious with it, as meaning I've added some more planners. I have way too many. And for those of you that have been following me know that I am trying to reduce the amount of um, planners I have. And especially lately because um, I am trying out a digital planner i never thought i would try that but i'm trying it out and it seems to be working so far um it's only been a week since i've been on this digital planner and the whole idea is because i was keeping a planner for my work a planner for my um, personal stuff and i was getting confused and sometimes was um, missing an appointment or you know because they get sometimes they overlap because some work meetings go into the early evening and so um, I don't realize because they're not on the same calendar and I needed to solve that issue. I will talk about that in another video and discuss with you what, what um, the benefits of doing this in the meantime, what are we here for? We're here for because I'm going to sell some of my um, beloved planners. I just have to do it. And I have a lot of good ones. Now, if any of you see a planner or don't see a planner, that is, um, ask me because I have more that I ha I'm not putting them on right now because I'm not mentally ready to part from them but it doesn't mean that I will not part from them. So just send me an email or comment down below and I'll see if I have what you're looking for. So the first one is, this is a file of X uh, personal size. Now this, uh, it's a beautiful purple color. I, do, I don't remember what the color is called exactly, but this um, I, converted i removed the the ring um device that that's the what what was here and turned it into a um a leather planner for a bound book and it worked for some time it's just the size wasn't good because this holds a b6 size it hold actually it's it's here because I removed it for the video. Um a B6 stology. It fits perfectly in there. Um but it's it's just not for me. You know how I need my planners to function as a wallet and there are not enough pockets here. This is in an awkward position, is it just doesn't work. So that's one to go. Next. Now, here I have a couple of file of access. Um, I'm sorry, I don't know the name of this. Of this, um, Maybe I have it here. Do I have it here? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I do, actually. No, I don't. Oh, yes, I do. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> um, it's an Aston file of X. I believe they don't do these anymore. Um, it's a very, very pretty color. The leather is extremely, extremely soft. So, um, 
yeah, I like this, but I'm gonna part from it. It's got these um, credit card pockets at the side. Um, I w you know what? I could actually convert this into a... But I, I... No, I shouldn't. No, I shouldn't. I should leave it as it is. Maybe someone of you would, would love to have this. It has a huge pocket here, so it's, it's, it's practically even for a wallet. This doesn't function as a pocket. It's just that pocket there, and yeah, that's it. And the pen loop there. It's, it's a very, very supple and soft leather. It's very nice. Um, I had bought it off another planner uh, girl on, on Facebook, I believe. That's that. The next one. Now, this is beautiful. This is a leather that I, I would enjoy because it, it takes up all the markings. I love that. So it would it, it would show use on it. It's a Lockwood Filofax. Once again in personal um in personal uh, size. It's got these um what are they? Car slots. You've got another pocket there and a pocket there. And then what's cool about this that the it's got an outer pocket which is very very practical. I find that really practical. Why I'm parting from this? And oh yeah, and another pocket on the front. I don't know. I do like this one, but um, I'm not really a ring girl, and I'm not sure this I would probably ruin if I had to if I had to remove the 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 ring mechanism. I think I would ruin it. So I'm not gonna go there. I'm just gonna leave it. Maybe someone would like to buy it and. I barely used it, maybe I used it for a couple of days, literally, and that that's it. I didn't use it again. Okay, let's move to the next. Let me just leave this here displayed so that uh, I know what I'm doing. And now, um, please beware that <laughs> I'm going to go from personal to pocket to personal again. It's going to be all over the place, but I'm just going to show you whatever I've got in the box. This is the Traveler's Notebook, the passport size. It's so freaking cute. Um, it's the proper Traveler's Notebook. Never used. Ever, ever used. Um, I bought it because I thought I would use it, but um, no, I didn't. And it's in its little... Uh, clot bag there and yeah another one next next is oh yes this is a b6 um gilio it's in the bicolor so it's black on the outside and that green on the inside i have no idea what it's called um oh dear I don't know if it's got written here. No, no, it doesn't. Well, this is a, an Apunto, of course. No rings, so it's meant to take in a B6 size notebook. Um, it's in a pretty good condition, I must say. Yeah. Once again, I I bought this. Yeah, I bought this new, and. I used it very little, but um, yeah, I used it a couple of years ago, never used it again, put it in its case and that's it. So that's another one for you there, let me leave it out of the case for now. Next one is, okay. This is from Naked Cow. I don't know whether you remember. He's He was a seller on... I'm not sure if he still is. Or he changed the name of the company. I think that's what it is. I, I really don't know. It's been long years since I've had this. This is such, such a beautiful leather. It's very thick. 
but very supple as you can see. Um, the size is a pretty strange size. So it can take pocket, but the pocket would seem a little bit too small. Okay guys, so I don't know what happened, but my um, camera decided to shut down um, and I realized that I filmed the whole thing and I had nothing. I had up to where I was talking about this one. So let's continue. So as I was uh, saying, this has a very particular size and actually the B6, B6 could um, fit into it, um, but a slimmer notebook, um, so it would fit um, a lot better. So that's the other one. As I said, it's by Naked Cow. Um, okay, now. This is a Filofax um, uh, pocket. It's got uh, um, the zipper here. I, I don't remember what this one is called, but I think it, the name, it, it had something to do with the cross. Um, it, it's leather, it's a very, very nice peachy color. It's got the card slots over there. You've got the pen loop, the mechanism, the back pocket. A very nice one, I must say. There. And next is a vendor's pack um, A6 cover. Now, this this is very, very beautiful. Um, so, um, you've got the back pocket, you've got the card slots there and there, another slot there, and the pocket there. And the pen loop over there with the elastic. Um, I'm not sure about the leather. If I'm not mistaken, this is Italian leather and this is Janet leather, the famous Janet leather. I haven't bought um, from vendors back for years now, so I'm not sure if she still carries these same. Um, they still carry these same. Um, letters so apologies for that okay and um, move on to the next one the next one I've got is this is a planner cover from Eberhardt and um, it's very very nice this is one of the latest I got made and um, for a week's cover um, customized it's very plain and it's got a, a chunky uh, pen loop where probably a fountain pen would fit there easily. It's very, very supple, very, very nice. And I, I asked for the chunky strap because I really, really like that. And it's got um, the engraving she for basically she empowered. But um, yeah, I have to part from that as well because this is one of the sizes I really, really enjoy using. It's for, for the week's cover, for the week's notebook. Um, and I've got way too many and I guess a couple would be enough to have. Okay, so that's that. Now, another week's cover. And this is once again from Vendor Spec, customized once again. And this is the ideal um, planner cover um, for a wallet and a planner in one. Why? Because you've got all these card slots. You've got a pocket there, a pocket there, a pocket there, pocket there. And you've also got this zipper where you can keep your coins easily accessible um, you've got also that little notch there so that it doesn't scratch your the, um, planner you've got an elasticated pen loop um, very nice I have no idea what the leather is but it's very very nice leather It's the type of leather it's not it's not like very textured the inside one is very textured but this red one is not very textured but 
the beating and the use of, of the leather shows. So for any one of you that enjoy having um, a planner that shows its time, this would be it. Very pretty. Okay. And okay, every so often I need to check and make sure that this is filming. Okay, it is. We're still getting on. All right. So this is a Chic Sparrow um, cover. This is one of the very first I had bought in the very beginning of time when before I went down the rabbit hole, basically. Um, this was from Chic Sparrow and it's, I believe this was, this leather was called Black Beauty. Um, it's very thick, but very supple. And it's got a lot of texture. It's beautiful. Um, it's very plain, so it's a TN cover. You just got the elastics there. I had put in some um, pockets there and there. Um, otherwise... And also, it has an engraving. I now, I doubt you can see that. And the word of the year for me at that time was believe, and so I got that and bossed there. Another one from Chic Sparrow. Now this is a pocket size um, TN cover. I got this from Etsy, an Etsy shop. No idea who it is, sorry. It's been a while, believe me. Um, I put this in myself and this I put in myself as well, a uh, pen loop. It's not going anywhere, it's very much, literally, no way it's gonna move. Um, it's a navy blue and there's my initial B embossed. Um, yeah, very plain, very minimalistic. Next, next I've got an A6 cover from the mo uh, Moterm. This is very reminiscent of Giglio, um, and except that it doesn't have a back pocket. So there's no back pocket. You just have the card slots. You, you have two pockets there, a pocket there and a pocket there. And you don't have a zipper like the A6 in Giglio comes with. And you've got a pen loop, which is not elastic elasticized. It's a very cute um, cover. The the leather is very nice. It's it's very textured. Um, red and blue. Yep. Yeah, parting with that too. Next. Let's see what we've got next. Right. Okay. So we've got that. That is a. Um, a pocket Excel by Giglio. Uh, this is in the color and intricate, 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 intricate. Oh, geez, I'm butchering that. Well, basically, it's a dark gray. Um, I love the I love the size, but I've got again, I've got too many pocket sized um, notebooks, so I don't need another one. Um, because this is ideal as well to be a planner planner plus um notebook all in one you've got the card slots there secretarial pocket your mechanism which works perfectly another secretarial pocket there a zipper there where you can put in easily your coins a back pocket there and that's that so that's a pocket Giglio XL this was bought new from the shop directly from the shop and as we're speaking of the pocket XL I've got another one this one is a bicolor epoca leather you've got the gray and the pink on the inside isn't that gorgeous um it's exactly like the the gray one you've got the zipper there for your coins um your card slots 
secretary pocket there, another secretary pocket, back pocket, a pocket XL by Giglio in a very, very, very pretty color. Very girly in my opinion. All right. Okay, continue moving on. Let's do this. And that's a file of X pocket. That's, uh, let's see how this, okay, you can see the, the massive difference. So I love the pocket Excel for that reason, because it gives you ample space for your paper and your pen to sit nicely there. Whereas this would be a little bit tight, but this, um, this has beautiful configuration. This is the Holborn. You've got the box packet, and, sorry, the back, I can't speak, the back pocket. You've got the car slots there, another pocket there, pocket there, pocket there, and I love this. You've got a pocket there, and then inside there you have a zipper where you can put your coins in there. It's, that's quite intelligent, I like that. And an elasticized uh, pen loop, very nice leather, it's smooth, but very nice. I think that's that's a very nice pocket planner for anyone who wants to be on the go in a small carry-all with your wallet and everything. Okay, moving on to the next, but before we do so, let's check that this is filming okay. So far so good. Let's keep on going. Next one. So we've got here is right. So that's a Lotus, um, the color is Lotus. This is an Apunto Slim by Giglio. Isn't that beautiful? I really, really like this one, but I never ever used it because I, I was scared of using it. Now I don't baby my, my planners and I don't know why I was scared of using this one, but I never used it. I got it second hand from the Facebook marketplace. <sighs> There's nothing to say about this. You all know the drill and where the pockets are, the configuration, the card slots, the zipper um, for your coins or, or anything else you want to put in there. Secretary pocket, your pen loop. Yeah, it's very pretty, but it's up for sale as well. Next, next, moving on. Next, another pocket planner. This is from Moterm. Now this um, is practically copying once again the Giglio, where you've got a zipper there at the side. You've got the ring mechanism. You've got a number of four, actually, um, car slots there. You've got a pocket there, and you've got a back pocket there. And actually, I'm looking at this right now. This could easily, I think, the mechanism could easily be removed. I believe so, at least. Because from what I'm seeing, even the, as you can see, you've got a place where you can literally unscrew these and make it into a, a TN cover rather than a ring bound. Okay, that's another one. Moving on, moving on. Okay, this is one of my babies, which I'm giving away and parting. I use this. I use this a lot and I loved it. Why I'm parting from it? Because I'm going to keep only only a few. I, I I have to. I just have to. This is in the burgundy color. It's so so pretty. I love it. The yeah. I don't know why, but they're so different. The leather is so different. This is my sort of leather. I don't know how to explain it. Um, I love the color. I love how it feels. But I'm parting from it. 
it's for the Hoboni two weeks um, and yeah I use it as I said but it served its purpose now it's ready to move on to a new home okay and now I've got an A6 um, from Orastel now this is a pretty intelligent planner I really really liked the the way the, the company came up with um, this composition and you soon see why you've got rings but you've got strings as well which is so clever I really like that so you could combine the whole thing you've got a pocket there you've got a pocket there and a pocket there secretarial with card slots pocket there and pocket there and this is also intelligent because this comes off so if your diary gets very chunky and this doesn't reach you remove this put it on the last notch if you'd like and this will the the, the strap will gain a lot of length and you you won't have a problem and there's a little um, intelligent pen loop there hidden underneath there it's very nice the leather is extremely soft as you can see i can and it's a bicolor i don't know what it's called but this is like a powdery blue and the inside is like a lilac color pinkish lilac it's very very pretty but I don't use rings anymore, especially. And this, um, I would ruin it if I had to remove the the ring mechanism. So I'm not going to do anything to it and see if anyone would um, appreciate this more than I do. Okay. Let's check again our camera. See that it's working. It's working okay. Okay, the next one, this is from Chic Sparrow, and this I bought in early days as well. Um, this is a different type of leather. It's, as you can see, it's a very pretty pink. And you can see the striations of the leather on it. It's very, very beautiful. It's very smooth, so it's completely different than the grain leathers, or the pebbled, pebbled leathers. But this shows up markings very easily, so it scratches very easily. But um, it's a different sort of leather. But it's nice. We've got the strings there, and once again, this is meant for the weak size. Okay, okay. Are we getting any closer? Are we getting... Oh yes, this is this is a baby here. Okay, let's let's explain this one. So this is the the Giglio B6 size. Is it B6 or is it? Oh no, sorry. This would be the A6. Sorry, the A6 size. Now I never had um I never used A6 rings, even though. I had this as well, but that was a craze. I thought I would use that size, but I never did. Um, this is the Giglio Miyakara in burgundy. It is so, so beautiful. And this is truly what I call a one place planner where you literally have tons of place where to put your stuff. You've got a huge pocket there. You've got a zipper there. Uh, which is pretty pretty deep it goes all the way up here and then you've got another pocket there if you had to pull this out you've got that pen loop over there you've got a pocket there a pocket there tons of pocket where to put your cards and the back pocket I mean I would literally consider using that on its own um without this insert it's so i mean it's the leather is luscious it's so so pretty this will be difficult to part from but i have to 
I really have to. So I realized that my video stopped once again and I know why this is happening. It's basically because my phone is heating up. Uh, it's, uh, it's something that my phone, particular phone does. I have a Google 6, 6, 6XL Pro and they heat up like crazy. Um, so when a video is a bit long, it just shuts down. I, uh, but thankfully I was ready. I did everything except for this one, which is a, um, a pocket size, which I had, had asked someone on Etsy to do it customized. It's so, so pretty. I had come across this picture on Google um, and it just spoke to me. One cup at a time. Take life one cup at a time. Yes, we always should. And she drew this on this leather. It's so, so pretty. But never used it. And therefore, I will part from this. I had asked her to put this insert where I can put in, um, once again, cards and coins in there. And it was ideal, but not ideal enough because I didn't use it and whoever gets this I will insert this as well which I had got from Mumsy and Bub um, as an a wallet insert sort of for a TN and whoever gets that will get that whole thing okay so thank you for staying with me today that was a very long video very difficult to make because of my mobile that keeps heating heating up but never mind we did it um so leave your comments down below um ask any questions um i'm ready to negotiate whoever would like any of the planners that you've seen if there is any planner that you didn't see that you're looking for just message me i might have it and i didn't show it today um just because maybe i'm not mentally ready to get to part from that particular planner but still ask because i might have it thank you for watching and until the next one bye bye